Vince a Pirelli, and I go so hard, these niggas petroleum jelly, more bars than his celly, more beef than the deli, I'm getting Rambo neck from a bitch behind the dairy, man, this shit is scary, all these fake hard legs, thinking they hard, we saw off dreads, word to the wise, I pay homage to all my dread heads, but I still rep bread, that's to my deathbed, tempur cushion to keep a nigga subtle, words of the wise will burst a nigga bubble, yeah, I'm straight trouble, trouble by life wasn't good with 7-Eleven, so I don't throw dice, then toss too many snake eyes, lost a lot of money, cursed out a lot of bitches, and gained more honeys, man, Shit is funny, but I don't even trip. Just go and tip a fifth until my eyeballs drip. Word, Ethanol used to be a nigga best friend, but it seemed like my best friend had a death span. Turmoil. They went all back there. All the bikes just came from the back of the police department. <laughs> Bike block. <laughs> Citizen in distress. That's why they they were flipped upside down. Oh, that's the that's the message. So that's why we had we had took them and flipped them upside down to everybody. You know what I mean? Mike yeah. Mike It was 99 cent at Home Depot. We thought it was a good idea. <laughs> Cause that's the symbol. You know what I mean? A lot of conservatives like that's the symbol. They know what that means. Back in the uh, 60s and the 70s, we did it to just mom. <laughs> PD 105. People driving by and supporting as the police are turning into the police department. I'm trying to come back for the big organizing rally. Um, I'm going to start a, a, a campaign to fundraise to try to help me get out here. I've already uh, figured out babysitting options and stuff for Ichi. Um, so I'm just trying to get that together. They do make a lot of noise. That's right. Say it's peaceful, but it's loud. Don't worry about it. Right. She said, nobody going to sleep until we get some justice. Are you want to sleep well and like, you know, a baby, but our babies is dead. You need to pass some That's what you need. Next time I will have one. I know mama got to put all the time. Platypus 64, hi. We 
got the mask, Mama. Courtney, uh, can you screenshot some of these from my from my uh, stream and tweet them out? Got mask in Ferguson. You can do the hashtag mask. And Hashtag Ferguson. <laughs> I'm about to get hit in the street trying to film them. <laughs> oh, the media is going over there with the police. That's News Channel 5 that just pulled into the police department uh, parking lot over there. I tried to get in the street and film and I almost got hit. <laughs> so I'm waiting for the stage. Mike Brown! Mike Brown! Mike Brown! What's his name? 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 Thank you, Fuzzy. Mike Brown. 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 Mike but it's like, it's not an unmarked van, but it's a big white van that just says Ferguson Police on the side and has blacked out windows. They're coming so they can fucking try to control the narratives. That's why they're here. They want to try to make it seem like people are violent, but all I see is people who are passionately asking for some attention so they can get justice because people are trying to sweep this under the carpet to my after Ferguson. Ferguson ain't over. The bikes are coming out. They're gonna go ride bikes. Hashtag bike block. Hashtag Ferguson. Hashtag bike block. From Oakland to Ferguson, bike block. <laughs> Yeah, of course it's a paddy wagon. It was only one, though. I expect there to be more, but they're probably parked down the street. Because earlier I seen like two or three of them. Um, earlier I was telling you that there was a couple of them down this way. Y'all got cameras? I hope somebody on the bikes got cameras. All right. What I heard is that he got pulled over today, but not arrested. But I'm not entirely sure um, what that was. Um, I just know he was pulled over. Thank you guys for marrying the stream. Hey, Rise PDX was trying to do it, um, and he was having, or sorry, they were having issues. Um, Maybe if somebody can get with them so they can try to figure out how to marry it too. If they're looking for a Ferguson stream right now. Let's get a closer view. I'm gonna we're gonna go over into the parking lot, huh? Yeah, but just not it was all calmed down by the time we got here last night. Oh I, I know. I'm headed over to the police department. This is a uh, the building is currently under construction. Hey, big bully. What they say, y'all can't ride your bikes. Ride our bikes on the street as long as we're obeying the traffic laws. Okay. So in the right lane, unless you're turning left, then you can be in the left turn lane. Okay. Thank you. They said all the all, they said all the police wasn't informed how we were supposed to ride our bikes. Um. So now they know. 
so they just gave them specific instruction on how to ride bikes. Is that is that what happened? No, they told us, they first told us we couldn't ride the bikes. Oh. Oh, okay, so they have permission to ride the bikes now. So I'm not going to go, you know, into the belly of the beast. Hi, but uh, we have the van and the SUV and several cruisers. And then we have News Channel 5, KSDK.com. Maybe somebody wants to watch them and see how different the narrative is between what's happening and what they say. But anyway, so as we can see, there is much more of a turnout. Yeah, I got a press match. But Kendrick came and he didn't understand. I was like, Kendrick, we, we, we have a help to play. 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 We have a help you can hear like a lot of people are driving by honking in support there is definitely a lot more people showing up um still looks completely peaceful to me though the whole world is watching yeah because riding bikes is a special thing we need instruction on <laughs> Peace. Says white America, we must acknowledge that the problem exists. Shame on Ferguson police and police brutality. Thank you. Brown and Black Lives Matter. Thank you very much for showing up, y'all. Um, I kept telling them how Oakland would have the speakers on wheels and we would be marching down the street with a big fuck the police banner, but you know, stylistic differences. I like to be part of the revolution that dances. C-Dub, who said, who made that quote? I can't remember, but I always remember the quote. You see, uh, there is supposed there is so basically what happened tonight is there was a white solidarity uh, thing. They're supposed to be marching, and it was just a bunch of white people who stand in solidarity with the. Uh, the injustices that are obviously plaguing the black community within Ferguson, which is pretty amazing. Um, so I'm gonna, hi, uh, my name is Bella. I'm a citizen journalist. And um, I was just wondering if it would be okay for me to ask you guys a few questions on, on live uh, air. Would that be okay? Fine with me. All right, hi, uh, my name is Bella, what's your name? Hi, I'm John Chantel. Hi, how are you tonight? I'm doing great. Um, what made you come out? Well, so I've been out um, and involved in the protests really since the beginning, sometimes on the street, but mostly doing kind of uh, support work in okay. the background. Okay. Um, but the Organization for Black Struggle asked that white allies turn out tonight so that we could um, show solidarity and support. All right. Well, thank you so much for coming out. Sure, yeah. How happy. long have you been coming out here, though? Well, I was out here Sunday after oh, okay. on the, I guess it was oh, August 10th, okay. uh, with the first, uh, the, the marches Sunday and Monday that happened right here. Okay. And then I've been in and out of, of the community here, but working with Hands Up. Um, and I'm a member of a group called the Coalition Against Peace, Crimes, and Repression. Okay. So the Coalition Against Peace, Crimes, and, and Oppression. Repre repression. Repression. Yeah. Okay. And so we've been working in the background to do support work. Uh, okay, cool. Yeah. So working on Justice Department issues, civilian review issues, okay, and then um, supporting our organizers who are out here on the street. So that's a national organization, or it's just state? Um, um, no, we're a local organization. Okay. Um, but since this shooting, really, we've begun to um, 
network with people around the country right and so part of our work has been involved with bringing other groups in and so that they could support us and help build capacity and so that we could start to build a national network around police brutality issues okay do you have any contact information um there i have a lot of people watching my stream there may be people who are interested in getting involved sure sure uh we have a facebook page which is called Real Local Control and Effective Civilian Review. Real Local Control and Effective Civilian Review right. on Facebook. Yeah, it's all about how we need to have citizen input into our police departments. And okay. that's probably the best way to reach us. Okay. All right. Well, yep. thank you so much. Okay. What's your name again? John Chasnoff. John Chasnoff, everybody. Thank you so much. Thank you. Appreciate it. <laughs> so, like, yeah, there's the White Solidarity March, I believe, um, that's coming out, that's about to happen. Yeah, we got some mods in here. Close. I mean, not too close. But can you check the status on the mine? On mine too? Can you check them? Thank you, Citizen Media. a white solidarity march happening. I feel like that's so interesting.
Absolutely love the energy. Talk about people who refuse to be uh, dragged down.
from day one.
could not ride the bike in the street. The sign down there, he said it. He said it. I'm giving you one warning. Well, you've been warned. If I see you in the street with your bike, I'm gonna rush you. We were in this lane. The sign down there says, bicycles get full use of the lane. It says so, that. Single file. So the the sign doesn't say that. I'm just saying it doesn't. Well, I mean, that's a lot. I agree. I'm okay with that. Okay. Now, Mr. Harris, this is what we need to do. That's what he said. You know it. You have to convey that to the rest of the office. I think it's a miscommunication. So when they see us on the bike, they pull it up saying, you guys have been warned, you're getting arrested, and now it's irritating the situation. So they didn't know what was going on. So we need to get back again. Here, though, is everybody's coming out either. No, no, we, we were getting bike. ready to form the bike. He was he automatically no, talking about, about everybody, though. No, I don't really care about them. They can do what they want to do. I'm talking about the bike riding. So we need to convey it to each office. I don't know if you guys talk and let them know that it's protocol for us to line up and we're going to go. There's a single file bike law. 
That's a sign. That's There's right. a single file bike law? Okay. Like you have to ride single file? It's like, if you it's like somebody else else track. a motorcycle. Yeah. Mm -hmm. If you don't ride double, you ride behind so, each other. Okay. 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 So we're okay. And technically, so far to know, you guys need to use hand signals. Just so nobody runs into the back. Have you had any complaints today about us riding our bikes? Just from a few people, not very many people. Yeah. And we ain't making complaints of the guy if I'm going to hit him. So we're not going to complain about it. Single file. Hand signals. We done that. That's just for your safety, your hand signals. We just don't want them. We just don't say anything to us unless we're breaking the law. For real. You know what I was talking about. It's just a lot of tasers and vests and shit for bikes. I mean, people are singing and dancing in the street. That doesn't necessarily, to me, equate to like a violent situation. I see people who are like revolting, well, participating in a revolution of sorts, but like dancing and singing. They're creating music that's conscious, talking about they want justice. Excuse me. And they're being agitated. What's your, tell me what you're streaming on and what's your username. Oh, I'm on Ustream as, just, I think it's just Fox. It's either Fox or Community. Fox or Streaming. Sa Sasha Streaming. Sasha Streaming on Ustream. Uh, she's somebody that, one of the people I rode up here with, she's going to be streaming as well. So if you guys want to bounce back and forth for like different uh, perspectives, but also like if I go down um, and you guys are worried, she's another person I'm with. And they riding in a straight line down the street. And the protesters have to stay on the sidewalk, is what's being said. We young, we strong, we marching all night long. Um, they look like NLG legal observers with the green hats on over there. Indict them cops. I know they're lying about the law. Courtney Occupy has all of my information. If anything happens to me, she has everything that's necessary um, in order for you guys to find me in the system or whatever. Okay, I'm just waiting for the uh, lights or whatever for me to be able to cross so I can go back over there because I like that side better. <laughs> yeah, the green hat, the legal observers, I think that's an LG. Oh, look at him. He's serious. You said yeah, fuck them yeah. niggas, fuck the, fuck the street, niggas. I feel him. No, but I'm just saying. Oh. No, no, no. We just face the street. I guess they gon' step it. Yeah, I got a website. I haven't been writing as many blogs as I used to, but it looks like the police are right here.
duct tape on her back handle, a whole roll of it. Uh-huh. That's Sasha streaming over there. She has a, a view of the police. In the crowd from across the street. I'm in the crowd filming. Um, and we just trying to cover all angles. Like if the police do something, we definitely want to catch it. Um, that's pretty much it. Because they are unchecked and out of control. The whole world is fucking watching. Thank you, y'all. <laughs> Here come the bicycles. 
she been going all day. Her right there. I'm surprised she even got a voice too. Don't give us our shit. We gonna shut that shit down. I respect they mind. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Then they got um, several cruisers. Like from what I can see here, it's like one cruiser, and then like two SUVs, and then there's a van, um, and the paddy wagon van. Look like they're ready to take people. It looks like there's actually another paddy wagon behind this one. It's, I was, I'm walking right here on my sidewalk please. but the media is over there and I'm trying to see yeah I thought he was arrested or pulled over I'm not entirely sure yet Um, she's Sasha Payne on Twitter. Um, I'm sure she's probably been posting her link out. Point is at least a hundred people here. Thanks, Courtney. Courtney, get this give me a break person. They need to go. streets are streets, but if it was they streets, they would take them. We strong, marching all night long. Okay, well, I got no choice but to leave, but believe Tepco. I don't know.
love doing with the lighters over there in the air. All I'm gonna say is, I was taking everything I got not to go dance with them and be all in the crowd, but I wanna make sure I can be objective. I believe that we will win. I believe that we will win. The best stop here, justice for Mike Brown. I am Mike Brown. Oh, okay. That's right, the upside down, we in distress. I understand. <laughs> Effective civilian review right now with the upside down flag in front of it. That's awesome. Wish I could take a picture. <laughs> Screenshot that later. I, I'm, I'm streaming live. Yeah. Can I see your sign? Excuse me, can I see your sign, please? Yeah. It's not my sign. I okay. Well, thank you for coming anyway. Oh, you're welcome. Are you a media person? Yeah, I'm a freelance journalist. Oh, right. Yeah. I'm sure. The way it was supposed to be. Not bought. <laughs> Can I film you? I just want to film you talking. Okay, okay. I'm done. All I got to say is I got everybody from Canada to New York to Chicago to Colorado here watching and support. And they want to hear what you got to say. And CNN ain't going to tell them. So, like, yeah. you know what I mean? Like, it's, it's okay. Just talk to me like you will. I'm just going to stand here. Is that, is it, if it's okay. If you're too nervous, it's all right, too. Nervous. Yeah. All right. Okay. <laughs> Okay. You she said you could do it just sneaker. Okay. <laughs> oh, okay. I, I uh, read his shirt earlier. Can I see your shirt, please? Thank you. Are you live streaming? Which, no, no, I'm 
I'm just videoing. Okay, you uploaded to YouTube? Facebook. Or something? Facebook? Yeah. Okay, um, do you want to, like, give people your information so they can go look at your videos and stuff? Oh, I don't. No, I don't want to do that. No? Okay, okay. okay thank you. Uh-huh. Bella Aiko. This, this is how you find me right there. The at Bella Aiko on at Twitter. Bella A L Aiko. Yeah, E I K O. Mm -hmm. right Bella Aiko. E I K O. I love it how you racist fucks bring up like OJ. I was 10. I'm like 30. Let that shit go. You let it go. I don't think of OJ.
No problem, Renee. Well, you were like, you're gonna win the Tour de France. You will. Hey, there's a cop. Right here? Yeah. The one cop. What happened? You said something about a cop. Watch him do which one? Because he wasn't listening to his commanding officer. Which so cop he, was that? He, I, when he come, I'm going to show everybody so they can zoom in on him because he's going to be the one to pop it off. The one that you said he wasn't listening to his commanding officer? When you know they said 11 o'clock, you're going to start lining people up for that. So we're going to just fight. When they come, we'll do a silent for a second. It's going down. I love him right here. <laughs> I'm telling you, if I was staying out here until October 10th, I'd definitely be family, y'all. You know. Y'all even, I mean, you do know. I guess y'all been watching me long enough. You already know. It'd be going to fuck down. We're waiting on the renegade cop to be pointed out. If somebody could uh, screenshot him and do the hashtag renegade cop when it comes around, that would be awesome. I definitely appreciate the online support for the stream. If you guys could keep retweeting, post it on Facebook, uh, MySpace, Ello, whatever you using today. Okay, Cupid, I don't give a shit. Everybody needs to know. <laughs> They need to come out. No, that's the same way when I was in Upland. I'm like, y'all need to come see for yourself because everything that these multi-million um, media conglomerate people are telling you are lies. If you come see for yourself, we didn't attack the police. We got attacked. We were just trying to survive. You know what I mean? And so it's like, they do it everywhere. Thank you, Grace. Now, the only thing I'm going to say is that if we was in Oakland, we would have been talking about whose streets are streets while we take the streets. But we didn't, OPD wasn't shooting us left and right with like live ammunition. So I can understand the restraint and then finding other ways of creative protest. So Trevor, um, you mean to tell me that American citizens are not entitled to due process? Like, so because they supposedly committed a crime and we haven't even actually addressed the issues of like innocence or not, before that happens, you mean it's okay to just shoot him dead in the street because he's black? I mean, I thought everybody was proud to be an American and all the shit that supposedly, what it meant to be an American. I mean, I think that's anti the definition of what people are like supposedly proud to be from this country. So like when you say shit like that, it lets me know that like you're completely ignorant. I'm just, I know I quit smoking cigarettes, but I feel like this is a vacation from that. I'm just gonna smoke cigarettes while I'm here, I'm sorry. So when I'm standing here is smoking a cigarette and then after I do that, I'm gonna get a bottle of water and walk around and film some more. I love, people don't even know we brought those flags for them. <laughs> but I think that it's awesome that they like the flag.
what I'm saying is if he did assault somebody, then due process is supposedly what was going to happen. I mean, I have issues with the judicial system because really it's kidnapping and ransom before we discuss innocence. I don't consider it a justice system, especially when you have many uh, black individuals who are in the lower socioeconomic tax bracket, so they can't afford this excessive bails and things like that when you have unjust laws that are constantly targeted at them. So when you sit over here and ask me about the type of person he was, I pretty much don't give a fuck about the type of person he was. The point is that he was a black unarmed man in America, and he should have fucking been, um, he should have been able to access his rights and have justice and due process. And so we don't have that, and so I don't really know or care what the fuck you're talking about. Hi, I love you. He was leaving. Yeah. I'm Bella. Not to meet you. I just want everybody on here. Everybody say hi. Can you tell everybody your name? Mike Brown. That's yeah. <laughs> you know, Mike Brown means we got to fight back. That's who I am, Mike Brown, baby. Turn up, turn up. Right, so everybody say thank you to him because when he got on the mic, the music went crazy and uh, the energy got wonderful. So that's him right here. Yeah. That's Mike Brown. Yeah, I heard about the bike. They got bike trails going on. They got that. They shot to get out the street. But we got a legal rights to ride our bikes. Two oh, men. Yeah, I heard. Standing strong for Mike Brown. That's right. I don't know. I haven't seen Argus News out here. I haven't seen Argus. I haven't seen uh, Internet. It's just been me. Maybe they're resting up, charging up, and getting ready to come out here. I don't know where Revolutionary Z. I don't know where Anon Austin. I don't know where uh, Argus News is. Weekly, are you from out here? You know him? Okay, Revolutionary Revolutionary Z is sick. That's why he not out here. Revolutionary Z is sick for everybody who's wondering, so he not out here tonight because he don't feel well. I don't know what's going on with Ain't on Up yet. Okay, right on. Thank you for tuning in from Indiana. Okay, Argus News is on his way. I just want to let y'all know that I am actively um, going to set up something tonight uh, to try to raise funds to come back to the big organizing event so that I can also uh, cover that. Um, I'm also going to need help like with the Wi-Fi cost because um, like I'm not going to work so that I can come do this because this is actively more important. My son is taken care of, but I will need support. Um, and so I am going to ask for that help. I'm hoping that people will be willing to um, kind of help out with that. Okay, I'm about to put my cigarette out and throw it away and go get some water because I need to hydrate myself. Um... Oh, so the police don't say I'm setting the trash can on fire or nothing. You see me putting my cigarette out and putting it in the garbage can. Okay, I'm gonna go get some water um, from over underneath the tree over here, if there's still some available. And um, I'm just gonna continue to document as much as I can. I'm gonna stay live as much as I can until the battery power runs out. Um, if people want to designate specific donations for me to go get more external power from one I'm out here, I will. But I think that we first need to worry about me making sure I can come back. Uh, I don't need money for cigarettes because I didn't buy them. I asked somebody for one. No, 
हाँ बात है onto the crowd because the crowd cannot hear them. It is hundreds of people here for sure at this point. If this is awesome. More police are on their way according to the scanner. Police are on their way. He has now exited his vehicle. Well, I'm just saying that they couldn't hear, the crowd couldn't hear him saying anything because I'm standing right next to the vehicle, the police vehicle, when he got on the speaker. So I'm letting him know, like, if y'all don't shoot him, like, let him hear you. You know what I mean? And give him a chance at least. Where's Sasha? Hey! Stay in my line of sight! You guys stay in my line of sight, you hear me? Here come the police. So you better get put them fucking flip-flops in your hand or something if they start to go down. You don't got to right now, but I'm saying get ready. Oh! One arrest. It was on one of the white solidarity work, uh, white solidarity people that showed up. There was one arrest. Um, the police are pulling out their riot gear. You see they got the, the clear plastic things or whatever, the uh, the shield. The crowd has moved out. Oh my God, y'all, please retweet this and put it out. Y'all know I got PTSD from these bitch ass pigs. Get this shit out, cause they about to act up. Ain't nobody even did nothing. We gotta go back as media too? Back up 
We've been directed by the police to come back across the street. Excuse me, Officer Harris. Officer Harris. Officer Harris. Uh, excuse me, Officer Harris. I'm trying to get some clarification. Excuse me, Officer. Do you have a public information officer that I can get some clarification um, about? What is what is what is that? Um I'm about to go across the street over there. Cuz they just I don't know why why the legal observers can be across the street. I'm not even doing nothing. What I get yelled at and tell the fucking come out of here for? So that's what I'm saying. I'm trying to be good. I'm trying to fucking be good. All I was doing was standing across the street and filming. What I get targeted for? I'm getting over there because that's where I want to be. What I got sent over here for? I am, and I'm going to go talk directly to the legal observers. Hi, okay, you the NLG. I'm, I'm sorry, yes. a legal observer. Yes. I'm, I was with Occupy Oakland, so I'm familiar with you guys. Um, well, Occupy Oakland, okay. so I'm very familiar yes. with the guys, the work you guys do. Um, I was wondering, like, I already know the answer to this, but like, they really can't tell us as media, especially, to be across the street um, no. with the protesters, right? As long as you're on the sidewalk and you're not impeding traffic. Exactly. So we just got forcibly moved to the other side as media. Um, I have it on my stream, but it just happened. So I'm like, they're. <laughs> already getting started like so um like i know you guys are just That's observing okay you know yeah yeah yeah, yeah. i was standing right where he is right now taking a picture we were we were right there when did this happen it just happened we had to go across the street when they started to and then i came and crossed the street over here i noticed your hats and i was like i'm gonna talk to the legal observers <laughs> They can pretty much give you a quote unquote lawful order to keep moving at any time they want. What did they say? Did you know, they say no, they just told me to go across the street. Just yeah. just go. Like that's it. There was no explanation, nothing. I was like, as media, just go. So, you know. Uh, that's the thing that's happening. <laughs> Does anybody know if Missouri has laws about wearing shoes in public? So. <laughs> For real though. I'm not gonna hear these. I know they don't care what the law says, but I want it documented on video that I attempted to be acting according to the letter of the law. Yeah. So how about that? I know they don't know. That's why I'm informed. <laughs> it's too much to ask the people who are paid to like know what the fuck they're doing. Yeah. What direction is this? Do you know we north, south, east, west? Do you guys know? Uh, I don't even know. I'm sorry, we're Mar the, the class. Yay! How you guys doing? All right, how about you? Good. We already got forced across the street as media with the crowd. Like from, we were not impeding traffic. We were not like, you know, obstructing their job or anything. And they forced us to go across the street. I'm wearing my press badge. Uh, that Sasha streaming is with me. And they're starting to move, like the protesters are starting to march. Well, I'm not gonna let them walk up behind me without filming. <laughs> The NLG observer said that they can give me a lawful order to keep moving, which means that if they say that, then I'm under the impression that I have to comply um, if I want to make my flight. <laughs> uh, 
Ain't on Ops Pro is streaming. Argus do? News is streaming. What did she do? What's her name? Ain't on, get her name. They took the little white grandma. Ain't on Ups Pro. Argus News is here. Sasha streaming on Ustream. I said, if I want to make my flight, I understand I don't have to. I ain't got to do shit but stay black and die. Them not only two realities in my life. Ain't on Ops Pro is getting a singer be searched and arrested. And they're a little rough with the old lady. Jeez. What? They're being a little rough with her. Yeah, they grabbed her by the arm. Like kind of yeah, snatched her yeah, like a kid. Yeah, like get your ass over here. Well, of course you're gonna take her over here now. Of course. We can't follow her closer because they only let mainstream media back there. The moment that I tried to uh, uh, step onto the property, I was told very angrily to move back. Um, you can see that the fire department is, uh, the firefighters are looking out. Um, they just ducked back in because they don't want to be seen like just sitting there and watching this shit happen, but whatever. Snatch and grab, crowd came up, protested very passionately um, against the police. There's nothing they can do to stop you from getting your justice. There's nothing they can do to stop you from getting your justice. And we gotta take instruction. We do this, we do it organized. We gotta take instruction. We gonna keep it tight, we gonna keep it sharp. Jonah? <laughs> They're gonna march. That's awesome, Sabala. I'm cheaper than Comcast. <laughs> They're gonna take one lane, march for a black, flip it, and come back. The police officer is. Talking about marching. Right, here we go. 
If we're taking a lane, man, y'all gotta be prepared to be arrested. So they said if you're taking a lane, you gotta be prepared to get arrested because the police have clearly really, instructed for people. Lane, to... Everybody, be prepared to be arrested. We're taking a lane. We can take it. Y'all, if y'all want to take it, we'll take Let's it. Go. So basically, he's doing a check and asking people what it is I'm that they're comfortable real. with, you know letting them be aware of the risk that they will be arrested. So basically, he's letting them know that um, the officer's orders were that they need to stay on the sidewalk. And um, so they're letting them, you know, letting people know that they're taking the assumed risk that if they go ahead and march and that they take a lane, that they will possibly be arrested and they need to be aware of that before they make the conscious decision to participate in the march, if that's what they're going to do. Um, so, like I said, I'm purely here in a supportive position to make sure that the word gets out. So I'm just going to wait to see what the crowd decides and then I'm going to follow and film. The white woman is the yeah, the, the white woman is instructing the protesters on the bullhorn. Make sure I got that right. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. It's supposed to be the white solidarity march tonight, ain't it? Oh, okay. That's what's going on. Okay, got you, girl. It was supposed to start around 8, so I guess that was the rally uh, of sorts, you know what I mean? Okay, let me make sure I update that. So here goes some, like, well, I'm going to keep my personal. There went some uh, citizens, uh, you know, uh, telling the police, good job. Hmm. Everybody entitled to their asshole, I mean, opinion. I would say that this situation is too volatile to walk up and try to get interviews from the police. Situation is very volatile, very It'd be different if it was like during the day when they were just sitting there, but like right now, it's not a good They They got their shields and shit. No. <laughs> we take a risk every time they go give instruction and we run it up to hear it on camera. Thank you, Kent. Hi, baby. You watching, Mama? You're watching Mama stream. Mama loves you, baby. This is a shot for my baby that's watching my stream from home right now. Mama loves you, and she she's being as safe as she can, baby. Okay. I only got the big one. No. I don't have another little. Here, take that one. You just need a little juice or you need a lot? I just need it while my other one is in okay. the park. Okay. We're about to follow the march. Okay, Nick, you heard me? We're not going to walk hella fast, but we can't leave them. You know what I mean? Run. Okay, I'm sorry, y'all. Give me a second. I'm trying to get my water bottle top on. <laughs> um, I'm about to switch to my other battery pack. Is that right? Is it working? Do you have another car? Thank you. Thank you. Oh, okay. Riverfront. Uh, she came and took pictures or whatever, right? Yeah. So the march is heading down uh, South Florissant. Is that how you say that? Florissant? Um, Thank you, thank you, Sabala. Uh, okay, we're kind of hanging back because one of our party ran to the car and we're trying not to leave him, but at the same time, we're trying not to leave the march without any video footage or coverage, at least from a certain perspective, since I know that there are other streamers with the march. Um, so since I'm back here, I can kind of keep my eyes on the police and their activities um, and see if they're like gonna advance in the back of the crowd. Although it seems like the crowd is going to stay on the sidewalk for right now. So if they stay on the sidewalk, then they don't really, uh, according to what the police said, need to bear any sort of like oppression or retaliation. Who? Yeah, cool. They're going to wrap around and come back this way. Uh, so. 
then we'll be in the front of the march. Yeah, that's what I said, Charles. It's the back end of the march. They're staying on the sidewalk. This is fucking crazy to me that they're staying on the sidewalks. It's like an Oakland person. We'd be all over the goddamn street right now. Jan, hi Jan. There he goes. Cool. Okay, cool. They've been doing it all day, y'all. <laughs> so I believe that the march said they was gonna wrap around and come back. Uh, I remember there being a couple armchairs. <laughs> um, I'm not entirely sure about couches, I can't remember. South Florissant and sorry y'all uh, fuck I'm old R Randolph South Florissant and Randolph huh? I couldn't barely see it Check that out. It's one of the protest signs. Okay. Oh, I keep. I used to sing in choir all through elementary and high school. Can't. Then I became a debater. Marching right now, too. Really? Yeah. So now we're on South Fluorescent Road, Fluorescent. Fuck, I don't know how you say that, man. And uh, Suburban Ave or Paul Drive is like one of those cross streets that like split in two. So far, the police aren't really tailing the march. People are staying on the sidewalk for the most part. Um, it looks like they intend on, do, you know, intend on doing whatever keeps them safe tonight. <laughs> support, support for Ferguson. Okay, they're in the farmer's market parking lot. Somebody's car overheating. Somebody's car is overheating. Okay, we'll fuck it. Hey, can uh, HE9S7M not hit a nigga though? The police are coming. 
down the, uh, you see the police coming right here. Stop police killings. Thank you. I love she's dancing. violently oppressing protesters who are obviously having an amazing time. Um, so, awesome. NWA was right. <laughs> <laughs> we love to end police brutality. That is awesome. Everybody say uh, hello to Mr. Awesome right here. That's <laughs> The people united will never be defeated. Yes. Oh. 
workshop to talk about defensive streaming, diversity of tactics, 
mic check in order like to get the attention of the crowd and make sure that everybody is hearing everything. Um, well, goddamn, I just really want to help, but I don't know what to do. Like, I don't know how to get people to hear me. I mean, on an individual level, I'm doing pretty good, but like to try to get people together to like Come on, Tony. teach them what it was that worked for us that kept us safe as streamers and stuff like that. Not even teach them, but just like give them the tools so they can have them if they need to use them. You know what I mean? I mean, but they need to learn the mic check too because they pumped and they need to be able to get focused when it's necessary. That mic check can be a uh, kind of like, you know, pause button on things. When we get back to the destination, I'm gonna shut the stream down so I can save it, um, so it won't be too long, and then I'll come right back on, okay? I had to take a wheel thing. <laughs>
they think it's a game, they think it's a joke chant. All on sidewalk. Shit, it ain't enough people for me to get in the street. All right, I'm gonna let the march funnel in, and then I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna shut down and come right back on, y'all. Got it. I see that. <laughs> how you doing? I'm okay. How about you? Yeah. Can you help me for this? Huh? Yeah. I'm like, you know, I'm from California, so I'm like, oh, layers. But I'm like, no, no, no. No layers. <laughs> Shit. Hold on. One more. One more for me. Help me out. Ugh. Thank you. Got to keep the jacket in the backpack. You know what I mean? Okay, sorry, still waiting on the march to finish funneling in and I'm gonna shut down.